Harrison, you've had a, a struggle here over the last four or five games. What was it that you saw tonight that let you have such a big night? And just how much did your team need this win? You know, I thought it was a great team win for us. Um, you know, anytime you're playing a, a Thibodeau coach team, you know they're going to play hard. You know they're going to play physical. So we had to meet that challenge early. In terms of me individually, nothing really changed in terms of my process. Um, the ball just simply went in tonight. Jason Jones. Hey, Harrison. Just the way the, uh, the way the team has struggled, it seems like you guys need everyone to chip in to, to be competitive and to get some wins. Did it just feel good to see not just yourself, but so many other guys chipping in tonight? Well, I think tonight was uh, one of our more consistent games uh, playing with physicality. I mean, you look at, you know, Rashawn, um, you know, blocking shots, everyone coming in and rebounding. Uh, you know, when we go back and look at the tape, you're going to see guards jumping in the fray, um, you know, getting a forearm on guys, taking bigs legs out. You know, those are the type of things that allowed us to be in this game, um, you know, especially with a team like that. Crystal Salters, Greece. Hello, Harrison. I would like to ask you what it means for you, the 94 points allowed on defense. What it means about your toughness and your willingness about that game? I mean, it was, it was big for us. Um, the last however many games, um, you know, we've been letting teams get above 120, you know, shooting, you know, well, be able to play their offense, not really having them have to work for their baskets. So, you know, be able to come out here against a team like this, who, like I said, has been playing well, extremely well coached. Um, it was a good win, but, you know, obviously got to have carryover with this. I'm coming here. Harrison, you mentioned some of the blocks that you guys had tonight. Obviously, it was a season high. Um, where did that kind of come from? I mean, was that any adjustment you make, or is it just one of those kind of anomalies? No, I mean, our coaching staff, you know, challenged our bigs, you know, just in terms of you know, anchoring our defense, you know, having that um, resistance. You know, we talked about, obviously, you know, with, you know, Fox picking up the ball high, but, you know, resistance at the rim. And, you know, I thought Rich, Marvin, uh, Mezzi, you know, definitely stepped up big, gave us energy, you know, cleaned up a lot of a lot of shots for us and allowed us to start our break. Jason Anderson. Hey, HB. Um, you guys, uh, you were out rebounded 33-25 in the first half, uh, basically flipped that on them in the second half. Um, how much of a priority was that and how good was it to see, you know, this toughness and this fight tonight? It was huge. Um, you know, coming out of halftime, you know, they had, I think, 19 second chance points. Um, you know, when you look at the score, you're like, man, that, that's the game right there. That's where we're going to have to be. It's going to have to be, you know, making their guards shoot, forcing their bigs to shoot contested shots over us and then closing out those possessions because – we continue at that pace. Uh, you know, we want to have got this win tonight. Come on. Hey, Harrison, it's got to feel good to get that one after such a drought, huh? Um, what was different about the uh, communication on the defensive end over the past few games? A lot of players have said there's been issues with the communication, specifically in the third quarter. Uh, can we expect that to hold? And who's been stepping up with uh, vocally in that? I think every every game is different. Um, you know, this team plays a lot slower. You know, they're they're more methodical on how they approach, but the physicality is different. You know, every game that we we've been in um, is different. So tonight, you know, our emphasis was you know rebounding and physicality. Next game it may be transits in defense and three point shooting, whatever it may be. So you know, we take it game by game. But you know, for now, um, this was a step in the right direction, and it's on us as players to continue to bring the effort that we did tonight into the next game. Tony Harvey. Yeah, there's, uh, you know, up and down the line with the starters, 10 or more points uh, look good tonight. But the second unit, I uh, did want to talk about that second unit. I just wanted to ask you, you know, what your um, analysis of them tonight, especially uh, Corey Joseph. He came up with some big, big baskets. No, our second unit was phenomenal tonight. Um, you know, Corey, obviously, you know, a bad coming in, giving us energy, making the right plays. Glenn has been, you know, really good for us all season. Tyrese, you know, playing with a lot of confidence. Um, Metu coming up big, energy, um, you know, really just helping us, you know, down low, you know, securing the paint. So, you know, our second unit did a great job tonight of really just coming in um, and giving us that lift. Okay, go back to Sean Cunningham. 
Josh, can you mention the physicality? Obviously, the Knicks are known as one of those more physical teams in the league. Um, how did you feel you guys responded to that? And did you see signs there that make it look like, you know, guys are kind of taking things personally at this point? Absolutely. I mean, you know, when we look at, you know, the past 10 games, um, you know, we've just been getting outworked. Um, guys have just been, you know, putting their head down, getting past us, going at the rim, you know, killing us on the old boards, whatever it may be. So, you know, with what we've been struggling with and what their strength is, we knew from the get-go in this game that it would be apparent whether or not we were playing hard. And that was a challenge that I think every guy took. And, you know, it ended up with us getting a win. Okay. Harrison, you good to go? Appreciate it. Appreciate it, guys.